Well, whatever time of day or night it is with you, welcome along to a game which is threatened, I have to tell you, by a rather forbidding weather forecast. The expectation is for quite heavy rain as the game grows older this evening. It hasn't arrived just yet, but it will do shortly. Glad to report, though, that that hasn't affected the crowd who are here. Has a hit! An early chance there, first of the game. Quick thinking and quick control, Peter. That creates a, a little more working space. Long needed to come up with a better ball. Ah, oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. And we have the first dead ball situation of the game, promising one. He'll fancy himself from here. He's had a crack. He's produced a beauty. <laughs> Everton took the early advantage. Southampton have played twice and lost twice. Can they make it third time lucky? Richarlison. Can he get through? Can't get the better of his opposite number. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Hits one! That's a half-decent try. Oh, that's a, an agonising miss. Just pure agonising. Corre. Long displaying his defensive capabilities there. That's no striker's tackle. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line in that defence, and, and he's delivering. Has a goal! Oh, taken with style! They have grabbed themselves an equaliser. Oh, high quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Southampton grabbed the equaliser, and we're all square. It's pulsating, it's absorbing, and it's hugely entertaining. Every single player is giving everything. Javier Rodriguez! Good challenge, he just stood firm. And it's to Kore. He'll have a go. Oh, that was no routine save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Gets wrestled off the ball. Oh, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Rodriguez plays it out to the flank. Calvert-Lewin. Keen. And we hit half-time. Well, it has been an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. It's a really interesting game, and they head in at half-time at 
Southampton get the ball rolling for the second period. Everton playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline. Converting chances would make a world of difference for them. Calvert Lewin. That's the through ball. Bednarek looks to bypass the midfield. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Southampton are making a change now. Southampton seek a performance here which reflects rather better on the boss. He's taken a fair amount of criticism in the wake of the last game. Look, some of the scrutiny is a bit over the top these days and you're damned if you do and damned if you don't. But he really didn't help himself. His decision-making was puzzling, to say the least. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. And it's Iwobi. He's made sure that that won't get through. Hoists it forward. Now it's long. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Ward Prowse. That had to be more accurate. That's a promising ball. And through to the goalkeeper. Calvert-Lewin. Richarlison has come loose. Richarlison was alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. And it's Bertrand. Oh, good take in a good area. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Long. Ward Prowse. Long gets it back. Ward Prowse. It is now or never. Time is against them. Tries a shot! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Oh, that was great pressure to force the initial error, Peter. It's the perfect example as to why this is a favourite tactic of a lot of teams these days. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement and when all of that is synchronized with the right pass That's what happens We have got changes here. And there goes the final whistle. Everton wins by the odd goal. It really could have gone either way, but a win.